everybody. Welcome to Music City Storytime. I hope that you're having a great day today. Well, today I want us to read a very merry day in the neighborhood with Daniel Tiger. So let's get started. It was a very merry day in the neighborhood. Snow was falling and lights twinkled all around Daniel Tiger's house. Happy holidays, neighbor, said Daniel Tiger. We're going to the Enchanted Garden for a special dinner with the whole neighborhood, Daniel explained. Everyone's sharing their favorite holiday tradition. Daniel wondered what tradition he would share. Do you have a favorite holiday tradition? Inside Daniel's house, the Tiger family was getting ready for the celebration. Dad Tiger's favorite tradition was decorating the tree. He even made new ornaments to share with everyone. Those look tiger-tastic, said Daniel. Daniel wondered if he should make something for his neighbors, too. Look how pretty that tree is. In the kitchen, Mom Tiger was baking her favorite pumpkin bread for all the neighbors. Hmm, Daniel said and sniffed the air. Your favorite tradition smells good. Grandpa Tiger was cooking his famous turkey stew. He even gave Daniel a little taste. Your favorite tradition tastes delicious, Daniel said, <laughs> giggling. Daniel wondered if he should cook something for his neighbors, too. But he didn't know how to cook stew by himself. When it was time to go to the Enchanted Garden, the Tiger family packed up their gifts and food and boarded Trolley. Happy holidays, Trolley! said Daniel Tiger. Please take us to the Enchanted Garden for the holiday celebration. Daniel still didn't know what tradition he was going to share at the party, but one thing he did know was that he loved to sing on trolley. We're on our way to celebrate with our neighborhood. Won't you ride along with me? Ride along. Won't you ride along with me? <laughs> sure, Daniel. We'll ride along with you. <laughs> when they arrived at the Enchanted Garden, all of Daniel's friends were there with their families. Jody and her family shared their special holiday pan pans. You might call them dumplings or pierogies, Jody explained. But my family calls them pan pans, and they are yummy in my tummy. Oh, the owl and Uncle X shared their favorite story with everyone. They were in the Nutcracker. Reading together was O's favorite holiday tradition. Prince Winston and his family loved to draw holiday cards. They even had one for Daniel. Thank you, said Daniel Tiger. Katarina Kitty Cat loved making gifts during the holidays. She gave her mommy a necklace she made out of beads. Making something is one way to say, I love you, Katarina said. Miss Elena's favorite holiday tradition was making paper snowflakes. Each one is different, she said, just like you and me. Can you guess Baker Acre's favorite tradition? He loved bacon. Baker Acre baked the biggest gingerbread house that Daniel had ever seen. Have you made a gingerbread house this year? Or have you ever made one? <clears throat> Soon it was time for Daniel to share his favorite tradition. Daniel didn't have any special food or books or cards to share. His favorite tradition wasn't something he could wrap up in a box of the bow. It was, let's see what it was or what it is. Singing with his friends and family. Daniel sang his favorite holiday song. Fa la 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 la. <laughs> Everyone joined in singing, dancing, and eating together. Those were the things that made the holiday season so very special to Daniel. How do you like to celebrate the holidays? Daniel wants to know. Ugga mugga. What a cute story. I hope you've enjoyed it for today. And listen, always remember, you are special. Until next time.